Backed by 30 years of expertise in the global fleet industry, Fleet Insurance Plus has just launched a new mandate of understanding and minimizing insurance costs for fleets around the world. So yes, indeed, we are, we are very pleased to announce that we have uh, launched Fleet Insurance Plus, a uh, Dutch-based company uh, built around the huge expertise and know-how of Ilko van der Wiel, a, uh, a guy that has 30 years experience in the global fleet uh, industry market. Uh, has been uh, one of the architects of the uh, existing lease plan structure uh, within Ireland, uh, but also supported other multinational leasing companies in rearranging their, their insurance structure. One of the key, key benefits that we saw cooperating with Ilko was, of course, introducing him to, uh, to our existing customer base for Fleet Vision, the consultancy uh, assignments that we do there, but also to bring um, Ilko into contact with multinationals where he was first providing more or less the industry from the other side uh, to the suppliers. We are now going to the end user and bring his know-how as, as a huge value add. One of the, uh, the, the key features we see when, uh, when looking at fleet insurance on a global scale specifically is to actually take away this final bit of uh, intransparent service and, and cost element within the overall uh, cost of, uh, of fleet. We also refer to it as uh, total cost of insurance. The key challenge for most of our customers is to really understand what their total cost of insurance is. Very often they either have that embedded with their service provider as part of the monthly fees, or they have their own corporate structures uh, or, or, or um, insurance structures, uh, or a hybrid in between. The key benefits of bringing that transparency to our customers is to really highlight to them that if you look at total cost of insurance, about 40% is not related to any of the, the claims or the damages that you occur. Uh, they kind of go into uh, premiums paid to brokers, uh, profit margins, uh, and also inefficiencies of processes. So that means in the end of all the premiums that you pay to insure your fleet, only some 55 to 60% ends up being uh, a cover for your actual exposure.